or talk. And let's just say it's been quiet for just one year. So we'll just do one year's worth of pressure and see what happens. So everybody keep an eye on the top. Just one year's worth. Let's see if anything happens. I don't know. One year. And, oh, did you see that? A little pop like that. That kind of eruption, that's called a P-H-T-T-T. That was a uh, 1.3. Nobody heard. Just a little dust. All right. Shall we go longer? Let's go two years. One year. Two years and boom. Now that kind of eruption, that's called a and that's spelled P B T T T. And what a is that's the kind of eruption that makes a volcano bigger. Nobody's hurt, it's just one after another, they build themselves bigger and bigger. If volcanoes did not go if they always went kablooey, they would not be mountains. They would be holes in the ground. And there actually are volcanoes that never go. They only go kablooey. And there are a special class of volcano called super volcanoes. There's about a dozen around the world. And these things are really nasty. If they explode, you don't necessarily have a year without summer. It could trigger an ice age. It could choke an entire continent with a layer of ash hundreds of feet thick, thousands of miles away. There's one right in the middle of our country. At Yellowstone National Park, there's this great big valley. And in the bottom of the valley are these geysers where the steam is coming out of the ground. The groundwater is boiling.